We humans have coexisted with the stars for many thousands of years. Stars represent life and death. They preside over the cycles of the universe and give birth to the elements of life. People have looked to the night skies with awe and wonder from time immemorial. But a catastrophe stopped these same stars. Relayers, those who seek the inevitable end of the universe according to its laws, and the star children who resist them. This is their story. Twenty forty nine. A portion of the earth, people, vehicles, and sh the city was destroyed in this tragic event. The disaster came to be known as the gravity loss event. However, mankind lacked the tools to the United Earth Government in Japan made the Meanwhile, in order to protect Earth from the impend, began to accelerate development of anti relayer weaponry in the 2051. Our story. to the day. No wonder I get It's been two years since I lost Luna. And I've been living an aimless existence ever since. Good morning, Master Terra. You appear distressed. Good morning, Yoraka. Guess you didn't think to shake me out of it. I do apologize. You woke up of your own accord before- I thought that I had let go and moved on. You told me you lost most of your memory, due to the shock of Lu- Which is perfectly understandable. One does not simply move on. <sighs> Where are you going, Master Terra? To take a shower. I'm all covered in sweat thanks to that dream. As you please. However, checkout is in ten minutes. Are you- What? I ask once again, why is it you didn't wake me up? Last night upon retiring, you stated, I'm tired. In addition? I occasionally enjoy seeing you flustered, Master Terra. Stimulates your intellect? I should put you in a junkyard. Well, where should we go next? 
Pardon me for being presumptuous, but I assume this journey to be part- Don't be so quick to assume. Wait. Nearly everywhere we have been to date has been a place that you mentioned. Mars is also on that list, hence the recommendation. Hmm. I guess. We're already on the moon. Incidentally, how do you intend to travel to Mars? The same way we got here. On that thing. Pardon me for being direct, but are you a complete fool? What? 80 million kilometers currently separate Earth from Mars. I guess it's farther than I thought. Oh, Master Terra. Your navigational ineptitude would surely see. Wow. No need to be so harsh. What is the matter, Master Terra? That light... No way... Oh, God... If you really do exist out there... Please... I beg you... Please let everything... About me, I'm more relieved to see you. And Thank goodness. I'm so glad you're okay. You flatter me, Master. But I really am glad. I was so scared I lost some. You say again. Please expound upon that. My, my sister. Everything burning, wreckage, people. What's going on? What are we doing? Uh, who are you? Himiko. Himiko? Star child. The first star. Himiko. I've come to find you, Terra. If you want... 2051. I met Himiko. <laughs> Damn it! What the hell is going on? Strange. Comms with both the base and GT labs are. What? Multiple heat signals incoming! What the? Corporal Max! Wh what's happening? Are we under attack? Quasar, what is its affiliation? Damn, comms are out. Did they take out the control room? Hmm. Guess they still want to live. We'll handle this. No. Leave this to me. You take the research. Understood. Answer me! Who are you with? Who the hell? I'm a star child. A star child? I'm the star child. Of the moon. Bringer of... A, a dark gear? No way. Dark gear. So that's what this is called. I'm relieved to see you in one piece, first star. I'm sorry not to see you in pieces, masked man. Just to confirm, is that girl the one you've been looking for? That's right. She's the star child who possesses the will of Earth. Hmm. So you're the one. Um, Himiko. It's you... No. Unfortunately. He's a monitor sent... 
They call me Observer. I've been sent by the... I sustained a terrible wound to my face long ago. Hey! This is no time for leisurely introductions. Looks that way. Relayers are the only ones in the whole... My star is saying they're relayers too. Then it must so. What's a... their hour? No. Everyone's... enemy? Relayers are disciples of dark energy who hold the fate of the un... They have one goal. To extinguish all life by... They're the ones who hit Artemis with the gravity lost disaster among... What? I believe you witnessed it firsthand. Gravity... Yes. I did. So hard for me to... And that's why the stars willed us star children into existence. Maybe you haven't noticed yet, but there's a star. And the Earth's will is inside my heart. Observer, I'll leave Terra to you. There's no... That's right. Your stellar gear is here in this lab. Of course. If nothing else, I've got sheer luck on the... I'm here to give them a galaxy-sized beatdown. But still... Besides, they don't call me the first star because I'm running. <sighs> I've been to so many countries and various places. A question, if I may. What prompted you to make this decision? If I sat around and did nothing, when I had the ability to help, I've been through two of these awful gravity loss events now. I find it difficult to understand willingly exposing oneself. Hey, you two. What you talking? We're here. Is that Astoria? I thought it fell and burned up in the atmosphere after fighting a dark gear too. So it survived its crash landing and been in her hands the whole time? Sorry for the wait, Master Terra. No problem, Yudaka. That was faster than I expected. Fortunately, I was able to establish gravitational relay. What would I do without you, Yudaka? Please, step aboard. This gear has already been spotted by my- I have no idea how well I can fight. But at least I'll buy- Of course. They don't call me the first star for nothing. This is my first time fighting in this. Up until now, I More than enough. Along the way, it's been outfitted with salvaged weapons. Okay, I'll act as a decoy. I'm sure- Please don't try to do too much. Dying won't help anyone. I know that. I swore I'd live on in this map. Master Terra, please allow me- Wow. You can do all that? I excel at it, in fact. Before you salvaged me from the scrapyard- Why didn't you ever tell me? You never saw fit to ask me. You can be sure we'll have a nice long talk once this battle's over. Understood. I'll do my best to ensure we survive to have this. Stella Gear Astoria. Ready to blaze trails. Let's get rolling, Adaka. It's time to move out. So this is the enemy. The real 
Let us proceed, Master. If the way ahead is too dark, It appears to be an ordinary quasar. However, as it's a... <laughs> this is one of those fancy new G... End of the line! I won't allow it hatching you up! Alright. Who do I kill first? I'll kill you myself. I'm still good. Stella Gear is hatching you up. All right. Who do I kill first? You're finished. <laughs> I won't allow anyone to stand in our way. Bad. Level up. All right. Who do I kill first? Eat this. And the gear patching you up. I'll teach them a lesson. Out of my way! Let's get rolling, Adaka. All right. It's time to move out. Who do I kill first? Got you! The gear won't hold catching you up. I'll teach them a lesson. Eat this. <laughs> Heavy damage sustained. Who this wants to die? Good. End of the line. Heavy damage stay commencing repairs. He's leveled up. Who wants to die? Don't mess with me. The gear won't hold up at this rate. Who wants to die? Got you! Sorry, but I have to pull back. 